is on fire. I have with me today the leadership of Recovery Church Movement, and we're here at Recovery Church Movement in Lake Placid, Florida. It's great to be here with you guys, and I wanted to take this opportunity to interview you guys and send this interview and the information around the world. So how great is that? I, I want to ask you guys, and, and first I want to tell you that on the end we have Pastor Max, on this end, we have Pastor Junior, and center, we have the founder of Pastor Phil. So we're just honored to be here today, and we're honored to be able to get this opportunity. Uh, a question for you guys. Um, tell us something that you would want the world to know about Recovery Church Movement, something you want the world to know. Let's start with you, Max. Thanks so much, Pastor Green. And those watching at home, uh, we appreciate that you're here. Recovery Church is a, just an incredible ministry. And we're both recovery and church. It's in our name. It's in the title. And we both serve the recovery community as well as the church church community. And we're a bridge to both. We're, we want you to be involved. If you're an addict or an alcoholic, we want you getting sober in the, the rooms of, uh, of NA and AA. And we want you serving at a church. And we are in the middle encouraging you to, to and helping give you tools to do both. And so Recovery Church is an incredible ministry that really makes an impact on the addict and alcoholic and as they're searching for faith we help them in that journey and if you have faith we help you build it junior thank you pastor max and pastor green and uh for me what i'd want people to know is this that god is moving in this place Right. God is moving. I mean, this is the reason why I'm here. This is the reason why we're having the impact that we're having. God's got us to about 30 locations and we're not that bright to do that. We're not that strong to do that. Right. So it's been God moving and he's called us into this and and it works. Right. So, I mean, t this month I celebrated nine years of sobriety, March 28, 2013. So the program works and the program was designed to lead people to Jesus. And we want people to know that. So. Uh, man, it's been an incredible journey. Awesome, awesome. Pastor Phil? <laughs> I would say that it's not those people, it's us. Um, sometimes when you think of the addict or the alcoholic, for whatever reason, we thought of those people under the bridge. Um, and it, it's the number one cause of death for anyone in this country under the age of 50 is overdose. And it can no longer be whoever those people ever were. It's us. It's every one of us. There's, there's very few people who haven't been touched. And Recovery Church is a beautiful opportunity to reach people with a message and a hope, transformation, help them find Jesus and a path of recovery. Awesome. 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 You know, the theme of this weekend's retreat is fruitful. It's fruitful. Tell us why fruitful. Pastor Phil. Well, some of the very first command God gives us is be fruitful and multiply. And then, and then Jesus comes on and he says, go make disciples. And our job as believers is to share the gospel, is to make disciples, is to see people fall in love with Jesus. And so we want to be the hands and feet of Jesus. And we believe that Recovery Church, what we're seeing, we're seeing redeemed addicts and alcoholics transformed. There's nothing that's going to bring God more joy than to see a revival break out from that community. And you can't deny that God's at hand. When this, when this person who was on the streets living in their addiction is now helping others live for Christ, it's a beautiful thing that will bring God honor, and we want to be a part of that. Amen. 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 That's awesome. Either one of you guys want to comment on that as well? Um, so to me, what I think about, and this just came to me right now, but you know, Jesus added the disciples, right? Like he went by and said, follow me, follow me, follow me. He added the disciples and after he discipled them, they multiplied, wow. right? So they all went out and they did what Jesus showed them. And that's where multiplication happened. And so we've been adding to get up to about 30 locations. And now we've gotten to this place where it's like, man, we are about to multiply. Like we've come here and seen so many new faces, so many new people say, man, I want to start a recovery church. I heard from this person and that person. So we went from adding to multiplication. So we really want to honor God in that way. 
And one of the things that God does is he gives us audacious goals. And if it was our, our plan or Pastor Phil's plan, it would be we'll add. But that's not God's plan. Our, well, God has given our movement a vision of having a recovery church in every community in the country and beyond. That's not a human-sized goal. That's a God-sized goal. And so if we're going to be fruitful and multiply, we need Jesus. And we want Jesus to empower this thing in a way that only only he can. And so that's why uh, as we gather together, we're looking to see how how God's going to work in and through us and just how Jesus is going to multiply this. So. Awesome. Awesome. You know, we've, we've been uh, happy to be a big part of recovery church being here this weekend. We brought a van load of people down for, for, for the retreat, you know, but I think the world by now is wanting to know how can we get a recovery church and plant it in our area because it's, it's essential. It's much needed. Recovery is needed around the world. Which one would like to answer that? Okay. Sure. <laughs> you can reach out to us. You go to our website, recovery.church. Um, we'd walk you through that, but basically we need someone who loves Jesus um, and is in recovery. And if we find that person of peace, you connect us and we're going to help come alongside you and see a recovery church get going. And also send an email to Amy, is it Amy M? Amy M at recovery.church. So if you're interested, if you have a church and you love Jesus and you want to help addicts and alcoholics, send an email out to Amy M at recovery.church. Send us some information about your church and let's have a conversation and we'll see what God has planned. Because again, we want to do what God has called us to. Uh, but I truly believe that God is calling us to have a recovery church in every city in America. So if they're interested, definitely reach out. How about every country around the world? Come on. Come on. We're streaming right now to every country around the world, to every city and to every state, letting you know recovery is available for you. Contact them. They'll be more than happy to walk you through. We, we came about in December of 2021, and we're up and running, and we're running as hard as we can. So we look forward to more of you reaching out, letting those guys know, letting us know. When well, you're ready for recovering your area. This has been The Bush is on fire. I'm pa Pastor Robert L. Green, the North of Virginia Burning Bush Worship Center, bidding you goodbye. Have a great day. God loves you. Bye-bye.